Police in Moscow, Idaho say they've enlisted an army of analysts to comb through surveillance video, searching for clues in the unsolved murders of four University of Idaho students stabbed in this off-campus home one month ago in what police called a targeted attack. Local businesses handing over surveillance video, hoping it will help. We're not leaving any stone unturned, but just you, you can see for yourself the vast amount of information the yeah. ever-growing amounts of people speculating and rumors and, and hearing new things. And we want to know all of that. And we're piecing it all together. Police still searching for the occupants of a white Hyundai like this one, seen near the crime scene that night. They acknowledge they're being tight-lipped about evidence in the case, insisting they need to be to protect the investigation. Progress really is being made every day. It is a, a process, though, that takes time and care. But the father of victim Kaylee Gonzalez is blasting police, demanding with a killer on the loose, officers release more information to the public. Steve Gonzalez saying they're just being cowards. There are girls walking around the street right now that deserve to know. He also revealed to Fox News that his daughter suffered big open wounds, and that the killer used a strong weapon. I haven't earned the ability to uh to grieve the way that I, I want to grieve. I want to be able to have justice first. The family is now raising money to hire a private investigator. Detectives haven't said who may have been the target, but Gonzalez says his daughter suffered more gruesome wounds than the other victims. Morgan Norwood, ABC News, New York.